Ang buhay OFW po ay hatid sa inyo ng San Miguel Corporation, Origani. We believe in a beautiful and natural skin. Visit us at Bangsar Shopping Center and IOI Mall, Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Black Pearl Wellness Institute by Marisa Del Mar, 3rd Floor, Glorieta 5, Makati City. Southville International School of Foreign Universities. Make the choice today for your tomorrow. The Global Education Leader, Southville International School and Colleges. Be amazing, be Southville. Buhay o FW, pangarap mo'y matutukan. Sa iyong pagsisikap ang araw ay sisikat. Buhay o FW. So yun pong pangarap natin sa housing industry for the past 25 years. 30 years has now become a reality. Thank you very much to Andrea. Buhay o FW, ang narap mo'y matutukan Sa iyong pagsisikap ang araw ay sisikap Show business, this is the world where the toughest tend to trend. But you have to be very strong to be able to survive. Buhay o FW Araw na naman po ng mga puso, mga kapatid, at nakapagpacheck up na ba kayo ng inyong mga puso? Kumusta naman po ang tibok nito? Magandang gabi po sa inyong lahat. Ako po ang inyong kapatid, Marisa Del Mar. At ito ang Buhay OFW. Buhay o FW Pag-uusapan natin ngayon ang iba't ibang klase ng pagmamahal at may naimbitahan po kami para i-share sa ating lahat ang kanilang love story. Happy Valentine's Day to all of you out there. I know you're missing your country. I know you're missing all the camaraderie here. I know you're there for your family. So, happy Valentine's Day to you all. Hey! 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 hey. Hey, lean with it, dab with it, hit the phone, now stab with it. Nay, nay, then you stop, then you hit that Molly Bob with it. Lean with it, dab with it, hit the phone, now stab with it. Nay, nay, then you stop, then you hit that Molly Bob with it. Buhay o FW, Buhay o FW, Happy Valentine's! Buhay o FW, Ang Yan lang po kayo at magbabalik ang Buhay OFW. Buhay OFW. Buhay OFW. Ang Buhay OFW po ay hatid sa inyo ng SP Land Incorporated. Set your sights on your new home, situated in the heart of Naik Cavite. Sterling Residence One offers you, the Filipino family, your dream home. Affordability, high-quality homes, security and comfort. Live the life of your dreams. Sterling Residence One is owned and developed by SP Land Incorporated, a Sterling Paper Group of Companies. Kedma Cosmetics, Feliz Mall, Marikina, Kedma Circuit Mall, Makati. And visit our newly opened Kedma pop-up store at the BGC High Street, Fort Global City. Buhay o FW, ang narap mo'y matutukan Sa iyong pagsisikap ang araw ay sisi
Julie Love is in the air dito po sa Buhay OFW. Kanina, sinabi po natin na nag kami ng happy couple para mag-share sa atin ng kakaibang kwento ng kanilang love story. Ang ating sinasabing The Vikings and the Pinoy Love Story. Let's welcome kapatid Robert and May Torzan. Buhay OFW Magandang gabi po buong Pilipinas at welcome sa Buhay OFW. Binabati po natin ang mga kapatid natin sa KL Malaysia, Sabah Malaysia, of course, Canada, Toronto, Vancouver, nang galing po kami dyan, Russia, United Kingdom, Saudi, Arabia, UAE, Canada, Hong Kong, Singapore, sa inyo pong lahat, magandang gabi po. We're very happy to have with us tonight ang ating pong Viking and the Pinoy love story. Up close and personal, let us hear it from our good Pinay na very successful and well-loved, May Chavez Torzon and Bob Torzon. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Wow, I can see the love. Talaga namang flying. <laughs> Talaga namang kanina while doing the makeup, holding pa the hair. My goodness. Happy Valentine's Day. Yes. 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 May, may I ask, you have been abroad for so many years. When did you Almost come? Almost 30 years. Almost 30 years. So from Manila, where is the first stop? Where's the Hong first Kong. country? Hong Kong. After Hong Kong, Malaysia, mm -hmm. then Indonesia, and half the time in Indonesia, we were in Singapore. Wow. And then after that, we went to uh, Thailand, mm -hmm. sailed in our yacht, mm -hmm. and then from Thailand, we moved to Canada. Wow. And then we just arrived here two and a half years ago. Two and a half years ago. Yeah. What have you been doing in Hong Kong that time? In Hong Kong, I was actually waiting for my um, visa for United States. Mm -hmm. oh. She was actually working with the U.S. Navy, okay. assistant to the to the head of the U.S. Navy in Hong Kong. Uh -huh. She took me on a couple of the U.S. aircraft carriers, and so I met her doing. She took a couple of my clients on board. Oh, so yeah. that's how I you met her. Met her in no, Hong I, Kong. when we when we met, mm -hmm. we actually um, I met him at his boat. Okay, um, we. Uh, a friend of mine, a mutual friend, introduced you, know. you to each other. Okay. Yes. Now, may I ask, Bob, how is it like when you first met uh, me? Well, I had a very, she had come down to the marina. I was living on a big 50 foot Chinese junk. Um, it was a liveaboard boat mm -hmm. of solid teak. Mm -hmm. And she had come down to go sailing with a friend mm -hmm. of mine. And they, he had some complications with his boat, so he brought her around to visit Jungle Bob mm -hmm. on my boat. Mm -hmm. and That's the opportunity. So yeah. he, he was playing guitar, and we were getting to know each other a little bit. And, mm. and then the next day, I called her. Mm. So I called her up right away, and I said, hi. She said, Would you like this? to have lunch with me? Okay, <laughs> Bob? <laughs> she said, who is this? I said, this is Jungle Bob. Okay. She said, I don't know Jungle Bob. I said, Jungle who? Who? <laughs> and then he said, this is Jungle Bob. I met you last night. Jungle who? Uh. And then he said, I met you last night with Richard. And I mm. said, oh, Mr. Thorson, hello. Ah, uh -huh, I then, see. So okay. that was the start. That was the start. And then you started going out together. So, uh, yeah, I said I invited her to lunch that day uh -huh. on the Jumbo Floating Restaurant in mm -hmm. Hong Kong mm -hmm. in Aberdeen. And, and I, I said, could you come to lunch with me? She said, mm -hmm. well, like Thursday or Friday, maybe this is Monday. Thursday or Friday, perhaps? Uh -huh. I said, no, no, today. Wow. Said, oh, my goodness, today. Said, today? <laughs> today. <laughs> How did you started falling in love and how is it the feeling of being in love? When I met him and then we started dating and then uh, it's basically um, for me sort of like mixed feelings mm -hmm. because I am falling mm -hmm. and then my visa arrived. Yeah. Oh, okay. And then he said to me... That's uh, a challenge. Yes, oh. and then now I have to say, no, I can't do this. Okay. So. And then he asked, I told him, I said, here's my visa. And then he said that, uh, please don't leave me. Yeah, don't leave. Ah, my gosh, you're a dramatic actor immediately. <laughs> please don't leave uh -huh. me. And then so uh -huh. then, you know. What is it that catch really your attention to Jungle Bug? He is actually um, uh, very supportive of me mm -hmm. that time, mm -hmm. you know. And then um, all in all... Loving was there, but mm -hmm. uh, in general, he was just the uh, um, most sincere, mm -hmm. most um, 
giving, mm -hmm. most, um, um, it's funny. Mm -hmm. It's I can see romantic. that. Romantic. Yes. So I think the whole package was there. Wow, it's perfect the for you. Package. The whole package. Wow, definitely. <laughs> there will be a third wedding. <laughs> <laughs> Jungle Bob, what is the first attraction? Well, of course, she was very sweet and very cute. Mm -hmm. very and cute, I see. Ben, ben. ben. Much, Up much, to now. Much <laughs> younger than me, but, yes. but uh, you know, I was... 46 years old and yeah. you're 20 I was 23 and he was 46 when we got married but then so a difference so 22, of 22 yeah. he was 45 I was 22 okay so a difference of 22. almost 22 years mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. so you know the thing was she was uh, she was clever she was witty mm -hmm. you know she mm -hmm. just had had the right thing for me I'd been around for quite a long time I'd never been married yes and Oh, this was I'd really never been married that? before. This was the right girl. No marriage, no children. No children, no marriage. Oh, no. perfect. He was actually um, one of my biggest supporter because I had um, a refugee house in Hong Kong. Okay. So, oh. yeah. Refugee, refugee house. house. For Pinoys, for yes. mixed. Yes. For oh. all, for all um, people, we gather. Um, we gather a lot of Filipinos and other Asians mm -hmm. at the airport, Kai Tak Airport before. Okay. Um, and uh, to those who arrives in Hong Kong uh -huh. who doesn't have the right visa or mm -hmm. they're fake. Mm -hmm. so and also no house to live. Yes. They've yeah. been cheated no by their agent. Oh. They yes. arrive there and they're one, they go at night at okay. 11 yeah. o'clock at night to pick them up. Sweep the airport. But the good thing you did your service, yes. not only to the Pinoys, but to all Asian yes. countries that yes. were there who yes. were stranded. Yes. And of course, I salute you for that. That's a very wonderful service. Jungle Bob, may I ask you, what is the most memorable moment that really struck you and up to this day you will never forget on your wedding day? You know, our wedding day, there was, there was freezing rain. We were in Canada. Mm -hmm. We'd gone to Canada actually to a friend's of my His wedding. best friend's wedding. I took me to Canada with me. It was her first trip. And um, uh, I had some business there as well. Mm -hmm. And then I, my family had a, had a ranch outside of Calgary mm -hmm. in the foothills of the Rocky Mountains. Mm -hmm. And I took her out there and I think I very much surprised her with proposing to her in front of the fire at the, at the ranch. I did not see it coming. Okay. Mm. And then, you know, when, when I told my friends, uh, my, one of my friends said, well, where are you getting married? And I said, well, I don't know. Maybe we'll go to Vegas or mm -hmm. something. Yeah, because we don't know. We just got engaged. Yeah. Next week, my ranch, oh. we'll, I'll, I'll, I'll put on all the food. You just invite the friends and I'll, I'll bring yes. the pastor and we'll. So that day it was freezing rain. During the wedding. It looked like wow. it was going to be spoiled because it was wow. going to be outside. In There's this, no tents. In this beautiful gazebo. Well, there was, but, the, oh, you know, it's not that nice. when it's freezing yes, rain. Yes, it's a yes. freezing and but raining. But then the, the rain stopped and the clouds parted and we got beautiful sunshine, sunshine. Wow. and we had the ceremony. So it was blessed. It you were able blessed. to do the ceremony? Yes, it yes. just worked. Wow. Yeah. 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 You see? It turned out to be a beautiful, beautiful day. Wow. Yeah. Now, you went to Cebu. What have you been doing in Cebu? No, that was actually, um, we have to rewind. Oh. Uh, Cebu was when I, w when I found out that I was pregnant with Leroy. Mm -hmm. Because Bob was wondering. Mm. We stayed in three different resorts or four different resorts for three weeks. Mm -hmm. And um, on our way out of town or back to the resort, Bob was wondering why I have to stop on the road yes. and just find a green mango. Oh. With and vinegar. With vinegar. Wow, <laughs> and sarap. So yeah. sarap. Uh. So he's uh. like, what's going on? So uh. I was young then, you know. Uh. Mm. And then um, not until we went to Allegre, Mm. And then another couple that we know from mm. Hong Kong, mm -hmm. she's, she told me, they're a British couple, and, they, and she said, sweetheart, I think you're pregnant. Mm -hmm. And I said, I don't know. Mm -hmm. And then she said, I yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah. I know. How come that you practically live in your yacht for many years? I was just hearing it earlier. How is it? It was a 52-foot sailing yacht. Okay. Uh, that time we were already living in. We were in KL. No, no, no. 
Oh, it, it, then we had moved to, to Batam Island, in Indonesia. Yeah, uh, in Indonesia. And I sailed yeah. the boat down uh, with a couple of crew members, mm -hmm. friends of mine, sailed it down the South China Sea, mm -hmm. you know, past the, past the dotted line, mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. uh, down to Kota Kinabalu. Yes, I've been there. Kota Kinabalu is very Beautiful. nice. And then across uh, to Singapore, and uh -huh. then we came into Nonsa Point Marina in Batam, just in time for Christmas. I had oh. my under instructions from under my instructions <laughs> from your beloved wife. From uh, my beloved wife, uh -huh. I had brought a Santa Claus suit from, or from else. Hong Kong, <laughs> and she had arranged a, a big a whole party. Expat, so the whole expat living in the island. In the so island, I arrived there in oh, time yes. to be Santa for all the kids. You were able to live also in Indonesia for yes. how long? In Indonesia, about almost eighteen months. Wow, eighteen months. Okay. And that's half the time in Singapore and. Um, at Indonesia, Batam mm -hmm. Island, okay. because Bob's uh, other office was in Singapore. In Singapore. So we go back and forth uh -huh. by, a fer by the wow. ferry. When did you practically move to Canada? We bought a house in the foothills outside yeah. of Calgary. Mm -hmm. and, uh, I have cousins that, in Calgary. That summer, and um, then we came back to the boat. So we, we were on the boat for eight months so really. during yeah, the Canadian we, we winter. Have, and we have the best of both worlds. Yes, it, yes, uh, we, uh -huh. go, we go to Canada four months a year and then go, s go in our yacht mm -hmm. eight months a year. Wow. Yeah. I'm wondering, you were married twice, me. <laughs> oh, you were married twice, may I know if it's the same Jungle Bob it's or another same person. Oh, it's you're so lucky. Guy. He asked me to marry him again and then... Um, Where? In, in Vancouver The Island. second, Vancouver. Vancouver it's just Island. A, it's just a it, love story. We, yeah. We had, then he we had the white carriage God. with it's the like horses. It's like every child, you want to get married again. Right? <laughs> 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 he, okay, he no, he what's the second marriage? Oh. Second marriage, uh, he asked me to, you know, if uh, he wants... He, he asked me if I could marry him again. Okay. And so I said, okay, so we'll take our... Vows Back. again, my goodness. So it was a very romantic setting. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's right on the, um, uh, what you call on it? On the point, on, on the, the beach. Point, on the point oh, of the beach. beach. And then okay. arriving, arriving with a horse and carriage. Mm. You know, very British. Very it was a lot of fun. Very British. Yeah. <laughs> when did you finally go back to Manila? Just two and a half years ago. Two and a half years ago. After 28 years of being away from the Wow, Philippines. my gosh. So all the children now are with you. Yes. Luke, Leroy, and Rafaela. That's yeah. correct. Okay. And of course, he introduced po natin ang lovely children of May and Bob in a little while. So you have to stand by. Magbabalik po ang Buhay OFW. Ang buhay OFW po ay hatid sa inyo ng Doña Maria Premium Quality Rice, available in white and brown varieties. Mas mapapasarap ang kain pag masarap ang kanin. Mi ponica, just ponica. Help keep yourself fit without giving up rice. Try tasty, fiber-rich brown rice. Just ponica brown, mi ponica brown. From SL Agritech Corporation. The Global Education Leader, Southville International School and Colleges. Be amazing, be Southville. Black Pearl Prestige, when luxury and quality meet. Black Pearl is the perfect combination between scientific professional skin care and high end skin care for personal use. Utilizing a cutting-edge technology to combine authentic Black Pearl powder into its product line. Black Pearl has established itself as a market leader in the luxurious and prestige category of the beauty industry. Black Pearl caters to those who want to look and feel at their best to shine and glow as a pearl. Cleopatra Mask this unique facial mask combines 24 karat gold with black mud from the Dead Sea, enriched with vitamins, plant oils, and extracts to deeply nourish the skin and enhance its natural luminosity. Black Pearl Prestige Inline Store in the second floor, Glorieta 2 Ayala Center, Makati. Greenbelt 5 on the third floor, our Black Pearl Prestige Inline Store. Okada Hotel at the Coral Wing and on the upper ground floor of the City of Dreams. Ooh,
Mga kapatid, nagbabalik po ang buhay OFW. Kasama pa rin po natin ang ating lovely couple. And of course, I would like to introduce the beautiful children. Buhay OFW, let's welcome Leroy, Luke, and Rafaela. The beautiful lady in the middle is Rafaela. And of course, Luke and Leroy. Now, I would like to ask Luke. You are also into show business. Can you tell us in what way are you in show business too? I'm in show business, but more in the in the back end. Okay. So I do more of like a management position, okay. um, rather than being in front of the camera all the That's time. Cool. Mm -hmm. um, I enjoy being in front of the camera. I like the attention, mm -hmm. but I'm better at being a manager. A manager. Yeah. And as of now, who do you manage? Um, well. There's a record label called Careless Music Manila. Careless Music Manila. And so I've been doing lots of PR for them, okay. um, and I manage their Twitter accounts okay. and uh, just most things social media and social mostly media. YouTube. When you arrived in Manila two and a half years ago, you really have to feel first, the right? feel the environment, the surroundings. Yeah, well, it, it was it was a big culture shock to yes, begin with. Yes, definitely. But. I'm used to it now, mostly, except for traffic. Uh huh. I don't, that's cruel. I really that's don't true. like traffic. Uh huh. That's but true. <laughs> um, other than that, it's it's really nice. I, I I like being able to to be somebody here rather than just being just another person back in Canada. Yeah. So it, it's really nice. And it's also very nice to know the real roots of your mom, the right? yeah. yeah. the Filipino roots, because you have been engage in too much on the roots of your jungle bab dad. <laughs> diba? It has to be fair. Yes, it has All to be right. fair. Right, exactly. fair. <laughs> okay, thank you. Look, Rafaela, may I ask? You're so beautiful <laughs> and your you. makeup is wonderful. What have you been doing? Um, well, I'm still in high school. High school? And so I'm in grade 12 right now. Uh -huh. um, but I have been kind of interested in business. Mm -hmm. um, I've been taking it at school and I've also been taking some online courses doing that kind of stuff. Online courses like what? Um, I just learned um, online sort of a drop shipping course and so I'm looking at making um, an online store and so I've made that already and I've also done an online course for uh, Instagram marketing and okay. Because I'm kind of interested. In wow, very know. young entrepreneurs, your children, me and Jungle Bob. Learn it from the father and the mother. She has a website store called uh -huh. shadygirl.com. Shadygirl.com. Yes. Shady yes. Selling, yeah. selling all kinds of sunglasses. Wow, yes. wonderful. I learned that you do makeups also. Yes, I do. Okay, you do it for yourself, for mom, definitely. <laughs> and once in a while, do you have some calls to do it to try or what? Um, sometimes I do it on my friends if they ever ask me to. Um, I've done a video on my YouTube channel where I did makeup like that. Um, really just, it's more of a hobby yes. for me. Yeah. Wonderful. Okay, we have to try that. Also yeah, for my daughter, Princess, because I love it, you know? You Very do. nice. <laughs> <laughs> also, you have a beautiful skin. Coming from mom, not dad. Okay? Uh, sorry, That's for dad. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, you're slim, you're nice, you're beautiful. That's the good genes of being a Filipina and a Canadian. Combined, it's a mixture of blood. My <laughs> gosh, oh, during the interview from the start up to now, they are really holding hands. What a love story. <laughs> they are so sweet. Have you really imagined you're still holding hands? And very tight ties as if May will be flying. Oh, you see how sweet. Really so sweet, no? Yeah. Bob, huh? really. And Leroy, may I ask you, Leroy, you are into business also? I'm, okay. uh, so I've been traveling actually mm -hmm. a lot. So after high school, um, uh, we as a family moved to Victoria in yes. Canada and we opened up a cafe and, um, and we were there for a while. But my, my real passion was to travel yes. and uh, I really wanted to move to uh, Europe. Europe. Um, and finally, after a year of working at the cafe with my family, my dad was like, okay, we know, you want, we know you want to yeah. uh, go and travel, mm -hmm. so go do it. Mm -hmm. So uh, 
they sent me off. I went to the UK, okay. and I started working in a uh, in a hotel yes. uh, for a while. I started learning how to bartend, and um, as of right now, I've, I'm I'm a bartender. Wow! So, what are you doing now? The bartending. So, I've I've, bar I've done bartending all over the world. Okay, I've done bartending in like London. International bartending. Yeah. Wow! Wonderful. Yeah. One time we can do it. Yeah. Right? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah. I've done like bartending in London, in Sydney, Australia. And right now, I'm actually working for a distribution company. Distribution uh, company, yeah. Like a supplier for space, yes. yeah. Oh, wonderful, huh? So you have been enjoying your stay in Manila so far? Yeah, it's been pretty uh -huh. good. You know, it's, the, the most important thing is being with the family. Okay, so. now may I ask, what kind of discipline does Jungle Bob and May just do, the three of you? You, Rafaela, what exactly do you want mom or dad to change when it comes to disciplining you, or it's just fine? I think it's just fine. Mm -hmm. um, they're not, uh, they're not restrictive, but they're also very open to me trying new things. And they're, I'm actually very happy that they have that system, and it's not like my friends. It's it's very open, know, open, yeah. Very supportive. Yes, parents. very supportive. Yeah. And of course, you have to trust the friends mm -hmm. and the, the daughter, but you also have to show that you are trustworthy. Exactly, yes. Yes. Right? It's okay. vice versa. Yeah, That's vice sort of versa. Yes. Because or else, yes. exactly. I can see that Rafael is good no man. Yes. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. I'm already culture. a spokesperson. It's a new culture, yeah. you know. And I hold the gun. Yeah, you hold the gun. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> hold the gun. Can you say that you have a special someone? Already found somebody here or none yet? Or you just want to uh, be uh, focusing on business? Uh, currently, I mean, if, if the right girl comes along, then sure. But if you're out there, hi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is, this is uh, no, uh, announcement. Okay. But, but for now, I feel like if I had a girlfriend, I wouldn't be able to put the time and effort into making the relationship work mm -hmm. so I want to just focus on business first cool. get that sorted out wonderful and then I can have a girlfriend because yes. then I'll have money to spend on my girlfriend yeah <laughs> you have to be stable first that's true because you have nothing yet to spend with your girlfriend and not just monetary but yeah. also and with time because yes, time, you need money. a lot of time to focus mm -hmm. on your business and yes. it's just not fair for her and it's not fair for me right. if we can't spend time together so oh, very open-minded yes. wonderful <laughs> open-minded get it from mom but, uh, if she's out there then it's okay follow me on Instagram. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's wonderful you know you have a very good sense of humor yeah. is it Bob I think it's Bob no is it Bob oh is it you jungle Bob you you have that sense of humor I think both of them but yes I'm 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 quite a joker I'm, uh, I'm I can always, see that from the start yes. uh -huh. and I'm always prompting them with you know poking them with my uh, humor you know yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's trying nice. to get a rise out of them oh you know? wonderful Leroy what kind of a treat that you want to get or follow from that? Um, I would probably say that my dad is the most, uh, how do you put it? He's the most driven, uh, you know, honest person that I know. Um, he's had businesses all over the world and he's been through so many, you know, ups and downs and roller coasters and um, I, I really want to learn from that and, you know, be able to one day uh, you know, manage or have a life where I can say, you know, something is mine. Yes. You know, like uh, he, he, he's always uh, had his businesses here and there doing everything. Mm -hmm. You know, from like condominiums to selling furniture, just everything. Yeah. Cool. And uh, like I, I want to be able to have something of my own just like he, he's had all his life. I can see you're never a spoiled brat, kids. No. No. You no, no. You're self driven, yeah. you're hard working, you want to make a name for your own and let your parents be your inspiration. That's the most important. And I would say that the love story of me and Jungle Bob is really one for the book. And having good <laughs> children like you do is already a prize won. That's fate and destiny. That's true. Right. The needle in the haystack. Yeah, the needle is <laughs> there. <laughs> Could you give us a message for our beloved OFWs and brothers and sisters all over the world and the Philippines as well? Happy Valentine's Day to all of you out there. I know you're missing your country. I know you're missing all the camaraderie here. I know you're there for your family. So 
happy Valentine's Day to you all. Mm -hmm. And that's, May? That's basically what I'm supposed to say. <laughs> yeah, but <laughs> Yeah, what he said. But uh, yes, Philipp Philippines is a beautiful country, and you guys are out there. I don't know what you're doing, but you know, uh, everybody's got their own job, family, whatever. Philippines is a, is a good place for vacationing. Come back here, yes. you know, bring your family. If you have a uh, foreigner husband, bring them over here and they can have a good taste of Philippines. Wow. Wonderful. Yes. That's yeah. very nice. It's more fun in the Philippines. It's more fun in the Philippines. More fun in the Philippines. That's why, you see, you have to retire <laughs> in the Philippines, not anywhere else. <laughs> yeah. That's why, because Bob loves you so much, that's why you are all here. Mm -hmm. Deba? That's right. Yeah. Look, message for our beloved OFW's expats residents abroad. Okay, I would say try, uh -huh. try Filipino food. I know a lot of it looks weird. But like, <laughs> trust me, bagaong on like those like green mangoes yeah. is really, really, really Love good, it. and it looks kind of weird, but it's good. Yeah. And so, try new things. Try try to assimilate into the Filipino culture, and just be patient because things in the Philippines you need to have patience, yes. <laughs> especially <laughs> from from other countries. So, yeah, just patience and, and try new things. Wonderful. Thank you, Luke, Rafaela. Um, I guess if there's any like kids there that have parents from two different places, like my dad's from Canada, my mom's from the Philippines, if you're like me and you don't know much about part of your history, then definitely try to learn more about, let's say, the Philippines and maybe come and visit so you can meet some of your family and see what culture here is like. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wonderful. Leroy? Uh, I would just have to say, all of the single people out there, Valentine's Day. <laughs> 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 correct, correct, correct. They're listening. Go. I, I just want to say that Valentine's Day is not just for the couples out there. Yeah, it's, for, it's, it's for everybody. Yeah. Yes. So, um, you know, make sure to, it's, it's cheesy, but make sure to love yourself as well as, 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 well as others. And um, your family. And, and your family. And your family. Yes. That's very nice. Okay. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Happy Day. Valentine's. Happy yeah. Valentine's May. Jungle Bob, Thank Luke, you, Rafaela, and Leroy. To all our beloved OFW's expats, residents, to all of you brothers and sisters, we love you. Happy Valentine's Day. And enjoy the love in the air. Magbabalik po ang buhay OFW. Buhay OFW ay hatid sa inyo ng San Miguel Corporation. Origani, we believe in a beautiful and natural skin. Visit us at Bangsar Shopping Center and IOI Mall, Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Southville International School of Foreign Universities. Make the choice today for your tomorrow. Buhay OFW, Bayan. Ito ay alang-alang sa minamahal Isusugan lang ang buhay ko kailangan Nang ang maguhay o oh, FWU There shouldn't be a season for love. We should live with it every day of our lives. Here's our small get-together sa Golden Bay Restaurant. Nagkaroon po kami ng intimate bonding with the family and close friends. Nagkaroon po tayo ng games and dance contest kung saan nandoon po ang grupo ng ating segment host na si Princess Adriano. At syempre, na to mention, sila po ang grand winner. Buhay o
then you stop, then you hit the molly bop with it, lean with it, dab with it, hit them four now stab with it, then they then you stop, then you hit that molly bop with it, lean with it, dab with it, hit them four now stab with it, then they then you stop, then you hit that molly bop with it, lean with it, dab with it, hit them four now stab with it, then they then you stop, then you hit that molly bop with it. Level up, 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 level up. Five, four, three, two, one. Level up, 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 level up. All this on me so yummy, all this sauce so yummy. No, you want this yummy, yummy all in your tummy. Level up, 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 level up. All this on me so yummy. Celebrating our Valentines with our loved ones, dito rin po sa Manila Memorial, kasabay ng isang taon na babang luksa ni Daddy Pole. Buhay o FW, pangarap mo'y matutupan, sa iyong pagsisikap ang araw ay sisi. Ibang bayan, ito ay alang-alang sa minamahal. Isusugal ang buhay ko kailangan ng ang mga minimit. May you rest in peace, Dad. Hope you're resting well and having an eternal peace. We love you and miss you. Ang buhay OFW po ay hatid sa inyo ng San Miguel Corporation, the global education leader, Southville International School and Colleges. Be amazing, be Southville. Origani. 
We believe in a beautiful and natural skin. We believe in nurturing the harmonious relationship between nature and science to bring you the finest in organic skin care. We believe you should not have to choose between quality and price. So let Origani be your luxury skin care solution because compromising on your skin care should not be an option. Visit us, Bansar Shopping Center and IOI Mall, Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Buhay o Buwan po ng Pebrero ay siguradong hindi lamang doble, kundi triple pa ang pagmamahal dahil ka nga, love is in the air. Kanya-kanyang bigaya ng cards, flowers, and chocolates. February 14 is a special day, hindi lamang po para sa mga magkasintahan, pero pati na po sa mga magkakaibigan at pamilya. Pero dapat ang pagmamahalan ay hindi lamang every February 14 natin pinaparamdam. Dapat ito ay araw-araw nating pinadadama sa ating mga mahal sa buhay. On behalf of the whole family of Buhay OFW, continue spreading the love and have a happy Valentine's Day. Mahalin at ingatan po natin ang ating mga puso dahil nag-iisa lamang ito. Buhay OFW Ang Buhay OFW po ay handang magbigay impormasyon Tulong at serbisyo anumang oras, anumang araw. Ako po inyong kapatid na handang maglingkod, Marisa Delmar. Kakampi, kaibigan at kapatid ng mga manggagawang Pilipino sa buong mundo. Ito ang Buhay OFW. Buhay OFW, pangarap mo'y matutupan Sa iyong pagsisikap ang araw ay sisi Be gone.